Um, we talked a little bit before your fight, and you seem like pretty at peace with your decision to, to hang up your gloves. But it's going to be a little emotional, right, to make it official. So how did you feel up there? You know, when did you the the, the realization that it was actually coming true? Like, how do you feel right now? Is that more emotional maybe than you would think? No, I, I think I prepared myself mentally pretty well for it. Uh, I knew going into it, win, lose, or draw, I was going to be proud of myself, and I already know what I'm going to do. You know, so uh, you know, my last three losses are all body shots, uh, and I have a responsibility to myself and to the fighters coming up behind me to understand when when your body's telling you quit, it's time to quit, time to hang it up. So that's what I'm doing, and I'm, I'm very happy with my career, and uh, I wouldn't change a single thing. Were you, were you feeling the body shots in training as well, or it was, it's just something that happens? It's a, uh, a coincidence, let's say, in the fights. You know, I, <laughs> I I work my core so much. Anybody who trains in my gym will tell you we, we work a lot on it. You know, I was trying to condition my body really well for this fight, uh, but I think my body's just telling me, hey, it's enough. And you got to listen. So when I got hit with it, it put me down. I, you know, I try to fight it off, but anybody who's been hit with a good body shot will tell you it's, it's a hard thing to do. I think it could be uh, something like you, 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 if you, if you, if you take a long break from from the sport, maybe one or two years, your body body heals. Is, is that is that is that a possibility for you to maybe come back in the future? Do, do you do you think about that? No, I'm not coming back. I'm happy. I got plans. I got things already set up and going that I want to do. I'm very grateful for the UFC. It gave me a great platform to get to grow myself as an individual, uh, to make the money to do certain things that I wanted to do. Um, so I have no intentions of coming back at all. I'm very, I'm extremely happy, and uh, I'm ready to move on. What's, what's, so what's your, plan? your plan? Yeah. Uh, you know, I got a few things in motion. Uh, I, you know, I'm going to spend a lot of time in my gym, but I have some other businesses I'm going to be starting and, and working on. Um, and so I'm just looking forward to putting all the hard work that I put in for the years. I'm, I'm known to work hard, and I'm going to take that same work ethic and apply it in other aspects of my life. And uh, I spend a lot of time with my family, and my growing family my girls, so I'm, I'm happy. In your opinion, what's the highest point of your career? Highest point? It's hard to say. I've had lots of fun battles. The highest points are probably losses. I, the Shirk fight, the Grant fight, the Dos Anjos fight, uh, all losses, but all great fights that I, I, I pride myself in. Um, yeah, you know, there's, there's too many to count. You know, I, it might hit me later on, but Right now, I'm happy with it. Think you would have done differently in your career? No regrets. No regrets. Why? Why would there be? I've, I've never, not trained hard. I've never, I've never not done the things I needed to do to put myself in a position to win. So how can I regret anything? You mentioned that it was a pleasure for you to fight your your, your last fight here in Brazil, but. Deep, deep in there, did you hope for, for maybe a bigger card or maybe a, a fight in your home state or home city to retire uh, in a bigger plat 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 platform? Uh, this fight wasn't about my retirement. So no, like I said in the cage, I didn't want to announce that it was my last fight before I got the matchup. I've seen too many guys that announce a retirement fight and they get an easy fight. I've never taken the easy way out in anything, and I never will. So, you know, I, I announced it after they gave I knew this was going to be my last fight. They said Brazil. I said, okay. I love Brazil. I like fighting here. I wouldn't have changed it. Anyone in particular you would like to thank at this point? All my, uh, my friends and my family, all my training partners. I've had a lot in the years. Every one of them has, uh, you know, contributed to my success. Uh, my main guy, Kyle Griffin. My dad, those are my two guys that, you know, have been with me for a long, long time. Uh, and most of all, my beautiful wife, Julie, you know, my little girl. So you know, those are the people I really care about. Everybody else is what it is. How, how did they react when you told them that, that this would be your, your last fight? How do you think they reacted? You know how they react. They're happy, of course. They always support me. They always have, they always will.